Good day. Thank you for joining me for another episode of Atari 8-Bit Gameplay. Now I have loaded up here a game that I played quite a bit as a teenager. Um, there's something about it that really tickled my fancy. Hit trigger to go on. All right, let's do that. Your characteristics. Strength 3, agility 3, luck 3, health 9, which I believe is the sum of those previous three attributes. Zero score, five lives, you are on level 1. Hit trigger to go on. Your equipment is dagger, leather armor. Select a dungeon. Uh, how do we do that? I forget now. Is that with... There we go. Joystick. Now... Oh, right. So there's a lot of randomness here. Well, I shouldn't say randomness. You have a lot of options is maybe the, the better way to put that. I don't know. We'll go with 10. And, uh, okay, hit the trigger. And are we starting now? We are starting now. Why can I not hear anything? Oh, because there's nothing to hear. All righty. The... Um, I guess I should have a quick look here. It appears that sound is happening. All right. Now, this game was unusual in that it uh, used the start, select, and option keys. Healing salve. Right. Trying to, I need to remember how, to, how this worked. How this worked. So start select an option, uh, next level, keys. Is it a trigger thing or is it a start thing? I don't remember, check weapons. No. Check supplies, trigger, ah, there we go. Trigger to go on, okay. So check status, all right. Check weapons, check. Oh, next level, no keys. Irrelevant here, I think. Right, locate trap is actually not a bad one, but then there's, you have to, I think, hit start to get back into fight mode. Yeah, there we go. So if you're not in sort of fight mode, you can't fight. Now, what I absolutely loved about this game was that it felt like exploring a dungeon in Dungeons and Dragons, uh, except that you were controlling the action. There's a chest. Uh, locate trap. I think we're okay. Iron Scepter. I think the, the, the loot that you may locate just has the effect of giving you points, basically. Oh, of course, there's a timer, naturally. Lead, lots of lead things. Aha, a fungus. Whoop, now I need to get into fight mode. Ooh, oh, he got me. And of course my weapon is craptacular. Yeah, oh, he can't move diagonally, right? I think if the timer runs out, you just go to the next level, if I'm not mistaken. Ah, here we go. Here's where you need keys, I think. Oh, I hit a trap. Dang it. Another trap? Are you kidding me? So my... I wanted to check my status and I went right by it. Yes, my health is now down to four. Grr.
Locate trap. Iron crown and a short sword. So, check supplies, check status, check weapons. How do I... How do you upgrade your level? Oh, there we go. Short sword as opposed to a dagger. You can also find secret doors and things. Go back to... Uh... Oh, there's a trap. I'm right there. And my timer is ticking merrily away. You know, I've, I've actually, oh, there's more to the level. I've actually been a little hesitant to play this game because I loved it so much. Um, back into fight mode, these bats are kind of a pain because they move sort of chaotically. There we go. There, two hits with the short sword instead of uh, three before. Ooh, a garter snake. Looks a lot more dangerous than it actually is, I think. Um, mm, 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 now this is a bit of a risk. Running around without locating traps and things. Oh no, I'm about to die. <laughs> Ooh, I can't have much hit points left. Arrows, okay. I'm not sure if I need a bow. Greater strength, yay! Am I healed? I'm healed. Uh, did I... Oh. Healing seven arrows. Short sword and leather and seven arrows. I honestly don't remember how to use arrows. We'll go for dungeon seven, I guess. I'm not sure if I need a bow or if I can just shoot arrows. A little searching... A cave rat. The cave rat has met their match. Ah, armor. Now... See what I mean about the bats? Come on. Now, I've, pi I've not picked up the... Tri the treasure on purpose because you can actually get the bat or sometimes other monsters to get hung up on the treasure. Ah, oh, I think I want that. Oh, I think I want that. Is there another? Hmm. I think I want that armor. Chain armor pit trap. So now check status check weapons there we go short sword and chain armor so i think that was worth taking the hit uh, i'm not sure how many hit points i have actually yeah okay that wasn't too bad that wasn't too bad mm. 
Okay, we'll leave that treasure alone. Do a little searching. Eee, that wasn't great. That is a bow, I believe. Nice, nice, nice graphics in this game. Oh, I am not doing a good job of fighting this. Uh, what was it, a slime? Okay, now I don't know how to use the bow, to be honest. It's been a ah, crap. Oh no! I reset the machine. Uh, see, and that's the problem. Like, the key, you're right next to the damn reset key. That's a pain. Well, let's, uh, <laughs> I feel kind of bad doing this. Um, hmm. Shorts heard right off the bat. Oh, I must have just gone straight into uh, into uh, level one, I suppose, or dungeon one, whatever it was. Dungeon one, I think. Oh, you stupid rat. I'm going to die. Come here, bat. So my own foolishness notwithstanding, and that's... I don't know if I can remap that key. I don't think so. Yeah, three health. Not so good. A trapped chest. Not great. trapped. That's a pain. Come here, bat. Not sure if I took a hit there or not. Uh, a bit of a risk, actually not. Short sword, okay. Um, hmm. <laughs> Can I just use that? Because I had a short sword before. Six, seven weapons, short sword, leather armor. Alrighty. Well. Bummer. Come on. I think I already searched there. I've just got this, as you can see on the screen, the search spell deployed. Hopefully I've searched thoroughly enough for traps through these areas. I think I did. I actually don't remember how... Uh, sort of how far down and up you can go on the screen in terms of where it makes sense to search for uh, where it makes sense to search for another short sword and a trap
a golden plaque. I think those lead ones don't have much value. You do seem to have infinite keys, which is nice. Oh, a scroll. Uh, I think my... Yeah, three health. I think I'm going to have to give that one a miss. I'm afraid. Ooh. Aha! My first secret door. Woohoo. With nothing behind it. Well... That was disappointing. Fun to find one, but disappointing to have nothing behind it. Other than an empty room. You know, I don't remember. I, I don't know if the if the items are randomized at all when you're playing, or if it's the same every time you play a level. The problem is if you're if you're in a scramble to hit that start key, like if I move my hand rapidly towards the keyboard like that, uh, which is what happened last time, you can very easily end up hitting the, the reset button, which is right next to it. Um, oh, picked up a healing stuff. Oh, you know what? That'd be a good time to use that. Then I'll go get that scroll. Let's do that, shall we? Yeah, back up to nine. And stun spell and a pit traps. Oop, I was already on the check status. Oh, I didn't even didn't even take my health down. Well, isn't that nice? We're running out of time. Oh a bow. Oh I should have checked for traps. <laughs> Five time units remaining. They're not seconds exactly. Whoa. Iron chest. Higher agility. Ten health. I think strength and agility, I think all of these things just basically help with your combat and maybe whether you take damage from traps and things. Alrighty, you are carrying arrows, arrows, stun spell, and a bow. I honestly don't remember if you can use bow and arrows at the same time. I think so. Well, let's find out. Let's uh, go to dungeon two this time, I guess, and um, try not to reset the game. Now then, let's, so we've got a bow and arrows using those. And let's have a look at the weapons. Okay, I have them all and I really don't know. I don't know how to use the bow. No idea. Oh, a shield. 
a small shield is that different than what i've got already or do i not have a shield i think i don't have a shield whoops wrong thing check weapons i don't have a shield nice meaning nice that i found one small shield so small shield Interesting how the creatures are limited by the boundary of the boundaries of what you've exposed in exploration. Come on, you stupid bat, good lord. So here we have the fungus getting hung up on the Ooh, this is a tougher a tougher. Holy mackerel. How many times do I need to hit you? Of course, you don't have as long a reach with your... Holy cow, what is going on here? Spells are... Holy crap. I was slain. I was slain. What I might actually do here is... Um, have a quick look at the manual while you... Sit back and relax. I need to open up a web browser. Go up to Atari 8-bit, search for Abshai. Click on Gateway to Abshai and look at the manual. Getting started. Gameplay, option key spells, weapons. The weapon you want is shown at the bottom. Press fire. It will appear on the weapon screen added to the list, such as bow and arrows. How do you use the bow and arrows, though? Okay, trap, search, spell, to explain some weapons, blah, blah, blah. Scoring, playing again. Well, that's not very delightful. How do you use... How do you use the bow? Check weapons, bring up the weapon screen. Yes, we got all that. Drop item, search, spell, locate trap. Blah, 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 blah. Option, key, spells, and weapons to use any weapon. Weapon. Fight. We must use the start key to choose between weapons. Okay, probably I should have figured that out all by myself. All right, how are we doing for time here? This is such a great game in my not humble opinion at all. Oh, oh, of course you get five lives. Spl. <laughs> here, here's me. So there's fight arrows, fight and arrows. Okay, great. But of course, the we start back on the same level, uh, which has now been obscured again from view but everything you picked up is of course gone which i had completely forgotten about golden scepter uh now what was it that wiped me out there was it that fungus or whatever i think so um i'm just gonna go back into fight mode hmm ah, i'm gonna grab it anyway stun spell Run away. This rat is pretty fast. Or whatever it is, I didn't look. So what did that do to me? Let's have a look at my health. It's eight. Okie dokie. That looks like... I think, I think we're at the top of the extent of how far the screen scrolls up, so there's not, you know, once you've reached the extents of the scrolling boundaries, there's probably not that much point in in um, 
you know, searching and things like that. So something to be aware of. Hey, look at that. Secret door. With nothing behind it. Just like last time. Ooh, a spider. A spider. Two arrows and the spider is gone. Good news. Okay. I don't think I dare try and use arrows on a bat, unfortunately. Come here, you. What I would really like to do is find another better weapon. So in order to play this game effectively and in sort of the time constraints, can I hang him up on the wall? No. You need to sort of use your your uh, keys all the time, which means moving your hands between your, your joystick and your uh, keyboard. Now, the, in, depending on the model of computer you had, um, had, you know, where the function keys were, or the, well, I'm calling them function keys. They were dedicated keys anyway. Um, in the case of my 600 Excel, which I do not have anymore, they were on the right-hand side, big silver, square silver buttons. You got more of a reach left to right. Then you do up and down. Okay, well, I guess the one benefit of losing a life is you get more time to explore the level. Yeah, the left-right scrolling, I think, is considerably more extensive than the up down scrolling thirty two time units remaining. Now you do have the option to sort of go to the next level, which, oh, come on. The lack of diagonal movement. Oh, I hit a trap, son of a gun. Come here, you. Why? <laughs> Annoying. I don't know how many hits I have left. How much health I have left. Come here, you stupid bat. if Confuse and Stun are the only spells, or if that's just the only ones you find on these early levels. This is, a, this is an extensive maze, wow. Ah, that was dumb. Tagged by the bat. I'm almost out of time. Might be smarter if I just run away from the bat. 
map. Hey, right on. Just in time for the next level. Higher agility. Agility of five. You were on level three. I don't know if uh, my audience will extend to me playing an entire game of this. Okay, now that we're on level three, let's go to, hello, dungeon three. Why not? Bow and three arrows, but I do have more arrows, so that's fine. That's cool. I wonder how many arrows you can carry in one go. All right, let us find the map. Oh, nice. Oop, let's not walk right into the trap. Of course, the map doesn't show you the monsters or secret doors. So where is the door? Must be back in room number one. There we go. Oh boy. I guess the monsters don't trigger the traps. Six health, okay. Ooh, a ghoul. Scary business. Uh oh, I really need a better weapon here. Come here, you. Ah! Damn it. I think my, my, the next, oh no, I'm stuck on the wall. The next hit I take is going to be my last, I think. I should probably, I should probably run away and get the bow and arrow, bow, get the arrows out. Come here, ghoul. Come here, you ghoul. There we go. Um, to search. Cave rat. Okay, I should be able to finish him off through the wall, which is, I guess, just part of the game. Not realistic, but I'll take it. Large shield. Nice. Is a swamp rat tougher than a cave rat? No, it is not. It is not. Alrighty, let's... Ooh, a shield spell. Oh, damn it. Oh, I've got to be just about dead. Two health. Nine arrows. I wonder if nine's the most arrows you can have. I feel like maybe. An ogre. And me with my little piddly short sword. Ooh, he's hung up. Wow. That would have been a hell of a running battle. Look how many hits. <laughs> this is dumb. I need to get a better weapon. Holy mackerel. Uh, probably, I, I guess I should get the arrows out. Like how many hits is this going to take? Wow. I would not have expected this many hits. Okay, all right, let's, uh... Are you kidding me? Wow. That's something. I should get a lot of something for... for, uh... beating an ogre. You don't get points for that, I don't know. 
if that plays into your end of level bonuses or or what uh, does this go anywhere yes whoops hung up in the wall myself ooh an amulet let's uh a giant will the giant get stuck nope but i will son of a gun oh that was painful i guess i should have used a spell on him all righty back to playing blind oh yeah right oh yeah right that didn't go anywhere well i'd like to find that amulet shouldn't be too big of a problem in fact it's right here if i'm not mistaken oh the giant there's no giant agility amulet well let's uh let's use that and oh look at my agility now nine i wonder if that's temporary long sword thank you oh an ogre just just in the nick of time oops got to change to fight mode i wonder if i can get him to go down So I I hit the other one with like oh I guess I have to I guess I have to continue if I want to hit it the most I need to sort of step into the wall at the same time so I need to hold the hold to the right I hit the other one with a short sword like 50 times and then I fired some arrows at it like four or five arrows I want to say holy cow this is nuts ogres are bad news even with a long sword like if you were trying to have a running battle with this you would lose i don't know if i'm gonna even win at this rate i'm just gonna time out before i kill it Well, I guess if it times out, it times out. That makes for some pretty thrilling watching, though, doesn't it? Come on, ogre. Die already. Actually, I don't have to keep holding right. I just realized. But I do have to keep pressing the fire button. This is ridiculous. I haven't been counting, but I must have hit this thing. I don't know how, well, how many times. A hundred? What are you supposed to do with it? Okay, what are my spells? Shield spell, confuse spell, arrows, stun spell. Let's try that. Oh, that didn't help. Okay. I thought maybe it would sit there and take more damage, but I feel like that didn't help. And if I go up and start firing arrows, it's going to run on top of me, and I will be dead. So I don't really feel like I have much choice here. This is nuts. Like cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs craziness. I don't know what else to do. Not fight ogres, but I don't know how you avoid them. I need a much better weapon, obviously. This is dumb. Why can't you encounter a monster that you have no hope of beating? Except with arrows, I guess. Maybe that's it. Maybe it's invincible. Except arrows. Oh, crap. 
Maybe that's it, actually. Maybe that's it. Only arrows. Oh, that would make sense, I suppose, seeing as how I hit it like 150 times. Well, I guess you gradually learn whoop, you gradually learn things. It's not impossible. Hello, garter snake. Feel my feel the wrath of my long sword. Alrighty, what have we got here? Oh a trap there. Agility amulet. I think my agility's already like maxed out. Okay, let's see. Oh, I don't have any arrows anymore. Crap. Wasting an arrow when you might run into an ogre at any minute. That feels bad. Come on. Four arrows. Four arrows to take out an ogre. Which I suppose I learned the first time, but I didn't realize that was the only way to take out an ogre. That's trapped. Oh, I'm going to pick it up anyway. Luck charm. Good. I don't know if those bonuses are permanent or if they are transient just for the level. They might just be for the level. Ooh, a ghoul. Okay, time's up anyway. The ghoul also didn't... Oh, do I still have nine agility? Can you go higher than nine? So I have a luck charm and I have an agility amulet. So let's use those right off the bat. Leather armor. Yeah, I really could use some better armor. Oh, I forgot to increment the dungeon. Oh my. Oh my. Forgot to increment the dungeon. Okay, so let's use the luck charm. Luck is now seven. Let's use the agility amulet. Agility is still nine. Okay, so it looks like those are the maximum stats. But they're permanent bonuses, so that's cool. Traps everywhere. Oh, oh boy. Uh, was that like a teleport? Must have been. Don't tell me spiders can only be killed by arrows as well. Oh crap, I'm out. I do have arrows though. Just didn't, wasn't able to equip them in the middle of the battle, or at least I wasn't um, I didn't react in time to do that. Okay, so the old teleport thing Come on. Oh, you have to actually hit the pixels of it. That's that's quite the collision detection. Everything is trapped. What kind of shield is that? A small shield. Uh, I do not want a small shield, so. 
use the joystick to select the item. Well, where is the... I can't tell what I'm selecting. What the hell was that? Use the joystick. I feel like there's something missing from my display here. I am using the joystick. Crap. Well. I guess I'll eventually scroll, get around to. This is weird. So if I don't use, if I don't use the joystick at all, Oh, this is annoying. Whoops. Well, that took an awful long time because there was no visible arrow. Oh, is this the unbeatable monster again? Well, we'll sit here and hit the spider, I don't know, 20 or 30 times. Yeah, this isn't looking too promising. So there's a lesson that I must have known as a teen, that you can only kill certain monsters with arrows. I must have known that, but I have no memory of that whatsoever. More than two. Four. That feels a little much, to be honest. Oh, here we go again. Oh, he's stuck. Okay. Oh, maybe that's a bit random? I don't know. That one only took two. So here, I think we're at the bottom extent that the screen can scroll. So a little, I mean, if there's a thing, you know, if there's a opening to the right, then it makes sense to use a search spell. But if there's not, not much point. Oh boy, look at this time tick by. All right, well, not even sure how many, how many lives I might have remaining here. Two or three? Oh, no! No more arrows. Oh, I hit a freeze trap. Are you, are you kidding me? <laughs> you have been slain. One life remaining. Well, I might as well play it out at this point. I'm sure uh, anyone that is not very interested, I mean, given that my average video watch time is like three minutes, there's uh, essentially nobody watching anymore. So, or I suppose people might skip through and look at the highlights. That's, oh, look at this, a mummy. Well, hopefully a mummy is vulnerable to a sword. Especially a long sword. That is a speedy mummy. 
All right. We have a helm and a trap. Helm. Let's. Weapons. Or your equipment, rather. Yeah, under, it's all under weapons. Could use some better armor, but having a helm and a longsword, that's pretty good. Okay. Whoop. One, two, three. Search spell. Back to fight. Traps galore. Teleport trap. A priest. Well, I fear those with good reason. You should all fear those. Kidding, 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 kidding. Catholic joke. Okay. Of course. Ah, let's go. Freeze trap. Does that wear off? Let's hope. Chain armor. Noise. And a secret door. And a mummy with my chain armor and my helm and my shield and my long sword. Maybe a better sword if I'm if I'm making wish list items. A better sword would be on that list. Disarm. Ooh. So there is a lot more to this game that I suspect that I... I don't know. I don't remember if I ever got much any more into this into the game than I, than I have right now in terms of time played. Probably. But, uh, oh, good. I was just about to start searching for traps when I found a trap. by walking right into it. A leaden scepter. I don't think that gave me any points, did it? A map. Oh, good. I didn't even see that. Just picking up things without any... any concern for my own health. Now, where? I think this is where I hit that teleport trap. It was all the way over here somewhere. Yeah, I think so. Was there anything of interest up here? How's my time? Oh yeah, still more. Still more time and still more to uncover. Oh, a ghoul. Good news. Um, yeah, you know what? I'm just going to leave that ghoul in the dust and go do something else. Now find another ghoul is what I'm going to do. Because why wouldn't I? Oh, miss. Swing and a miss. One, two, two. Good, good news. A spider. Fear spell. That sounds like a good one. Okay. Are we... Oh, yeah, I don't think we're scrolling anymore to the right. So there is an awful lot more right and left movement in these maps than there is up and down. I'd have to maybe 
well, I'd have to try and measure the length and width of it if I wanted to understand. Ah, there we go. How many uh, squares there were to a map, but they're fairly large. Um, Oh, a teleport, a teleport, a teleport trap. And an asp. Five, six, seven shots with the long sword. Yeah, handy. Ah, that asp that I was just fighting. What are you? What is happening? Oh, a freeze trap. I was slain by because I ran into the freeze trap. Game over. <laughs> Not we didn't quite reach an hour. So that's that's an old school game for you right there. Immersive. Replay value is all over the place. Uh, not all over the place. Replay value is just off the charts because you've got, I think, 16 variants of levels per, or of dungeons, I should say, per level. And I'm not sure how many levels there are. I still have that manual up. I might be able to uh, find that fairly quickly, actually. Uh, does talk about it somewhere. Ah, yes. 16 dungeons. Eight levels of Gateway to Apshai has 16 dungeons. So, and each dungeon has roughly 60 rooms. So there's 7,500 different rooms to explore. Each of the 128 dungeons has a di different floor plan. So that's a lot of dungeons. That's a lot of replay value. Um, anyway, love this game. I haven't played it for quite a while, actually, but uh, still very much enjoy the game. And uh, I don't know what happens when if you pass level 8. I don't think I ever accomplished that, so maybe you go out. Maybe you come back and try again, play some more. I don't know. I have no idea. In any case, thanks so much for watching. I hope you got some enjoyment out of that. I did. As I said, it's been a long time since I played this game, and I always liked it a lot. So uh, take good care of yourselves. Take good care of your family and friends, and I'll see you next time.